Hello, MC College students. This is Soda Garcia. Are you ready for the next MC adventure? To enroll, please take note of the following steps. Registration. Step 1. To log in to SDMS, type sdms.mc.edu.ph. Step 2. To sign in, type your username and password. The username is the email address used during application. In case of forgotten passwords, click on the Recover Your Password link in the SDMS login page. Enter the email address and click the Retrieve Password button. The login credentials will be sent to the email address provided. For a password change, log in to SDMS, hover over your name on the upper right-hand corner, and click Change Password. Follow the instructions in creating a new password. Step 3. On the menu, click Registration. Step 4. During Cycle 1 registration, you will be prompted to select your enrollment type. Click one of these buttons. Full Time. Selecting this button implies you're enrolling in both Cycles 1 and 2. Part Time. Selecting this button implies you are enrolling only for Cycle 1. Step 5. During Cycle 2 registration, the Enrollment Type button does not appear. Step 6. Your pre-assigned courses for Cycle 2 will automatically appear on screen. Proceed to Step 8. Step 7. During Cycle 1 registration, if full-time regular enrollment type is selected, and the number of courses appearing in your registration form does not match with the total advice courses found under the upper right corner of your registration form, click the Add Subject button. Possible courses that you can add will appear on screen. Select those courses that you wish to add, then click Add. If part-time cycle 1 enrollment type is selected, you may enroll one course at the minimum. Click the Add Subject button. Possible courses offered for the cycle that you can add will appear on screen. Select those courses that you wish to add, then click Add. Step 8 When done with Step 7, click the Assessment button. Step 9 Choose your mode of payment. Click the drop-down button of the payment term, then select the desired mode of payment. Click Save. Step 10 after selecting the desired mode of payment, click the Register button. Step 11. Click Agree and then click Register. The system will prompt you that you have successfully registered. Step 12. You may now print your official registration and assessment form or take a photo of it. Please note the following. Students who opted for the full-time type of enrollment during Cycle 1 need not register during Cycle 2 registration. Only those students who opted for the part-time Cycle 1 enrollment type will be allowed to continue to Cycle 2 registration. Also, those who are not able to register during Cycle 1 can register in Cycle 2 but can only take the offered subjects for Cycle 2. If before payment, you decided to change your enrollment type from full-time to part-time or vice versa, you can do the following. Number 1. Click Void Registration, then click Confirm. Number 2. Click Change Enrollment Type, then select your desired enrollment type. Number 3. Click Assessment, select the payment term that you desire, then click Save. Number 4. Click Register, click Agree, and then click Register. Step 13. Payment. After registration, you may now pay your tuition and other fees specified in your registration and assessment form. Here are the different modes of payment. For bank payments, Bank of the Philippine Islands. Banco de Oro. For other banks' account holder, bank transfer through online or GCash.
For credit card payments, the school accepts BPI, BDO, and Metrobank credit card payments. If you wish to avail of this payment method, please send an email to mctreasury at mc.edu.ph with the subject heading, credit card, underscore, HEU, underscore, name of student, for the scheduling of your appointment at the HEU cashier's office. Step 14. A clear copy of the deposit slip or confirmation page and the signed RAF should be sent via email to mctreasury at mc.edu.ph and mcaccounting at mc.edu.ph with the subject heading OR underscore RAF underscore HEU underscore name of student for verification. Step 15. The Office of Student Accounts will issue an official receipt or an OR. A notification will be sent as proof that you are officially enrolled. And that's about it. We look forward to seeing you at Noller, the MC online campus. So what are you waiting for? Let your MC adventure begin.